An update on last week's mass shooting in Miami Gardens. One of the victims, a bystander, finally home after being released from the hospital. Yeah, he was shot three times and says he's just grateful to be alive. CBS 4's Anna McAllister has that story. It all happened in like split second. What started as a shoot for a music video ended as a mass shooting. As rapper French Montana and his crew were filming near the Licking Restaurant parking lot last Thursday, a barrage of bullets flew and 10 people were shot. Attorney Josiah Graham says his client is one of the victims. And my client is Carl Leon. So Carl is 25 years old. He has a blog called uh, The Rap Come Up, um, and it, he follows a lot of artists, and, and he has almost 100,000 followers on Instagram based on, um, you know, this platform where you can go and find out hip-hop news, right? So he was invited there. As Leon stood in the parking lot watching the video shoot, he vividly remembers the moment he heard the shots. You know, everybody was dropping, but I ran. And I didn't notice I got hit in my hand until, like, afterwards when everything finished. And I was looking, and I seen the blood dripping. It felt like all over my sandals and stuff. And that's when I realized, yeah, I'm, I'm shot. Not once, but multiple times. Leon was shot in the hand, the stomach, and a bullet grazed the back of his head. If I stood there for another five seconds, you know, looking for somebody, I would have got hit in the head. After spending several days at Aventura Hospital, Leon was released Sunday night. Now, Graham is looking into a lawsuit to determine who bears responsibility. There's a restaurant there that, you know, we, don't, we know that there was no permit issued by the Miami Gardens Police Department for any type of authorized um, rap video. French Montana, yes, we are looking into him because it's our understanding that he had an unauthorized video shoot at finger licking. So we're looking into that. Reporting in Miami Gardens, Adam McAllister, CBS 4 News.